diagnostic, so that way we can figure out exactly what's going wrong with the board. We are doing diagnostic on a hash board. We want to do the same thing with consolidation. We want to do a complete visual inspection. So we're looking at the board. We're seeing if anything is missing, damaged, off. As you can see here, these heat sinks are crooked, so we probably don't want to plug this in without removing these heat sinks and seeing what's going on underneath there. So to do diagnostic, we're going to need a few things. One of the tools you're going to need is a variable power supply. Another thing we're going to need is a test fixture or a test jig. This basically plugs into the hash board to run tests so that way you can put voltage through the hash board. Another thing you're going to need is a multimeter. Also having some needle tips will help substantially because that way you can actually, if you take a look, you can go in between the heat sinks with it. You just want to follow that signal through the board and see exactly where it breaks. Um, again, if we're back at the last chip and we have voltage, you could go one chip after another until you finally get to the first chip to see where that breaks. Usually what I like to do though is, is that if you have voltage here, I'll just